was that? Eventually, we made our way back to Hollow Point. Got August patched up. There isn't much more to it. Life sorta of returned back to normal. Well, our normal. That was it. You destroyed Gordas, then walked away. Moved on with your life. Like nothing happened. I didn't want to shoot her. I wish there was some other way. What about you? After I came to, I grabbed the rights to Atlas on Pandora from Jack's office. Figured I could use it to build something. A fresh start. At that point, it made sense to head back to the Atlas facility we left. Got it going again. Luckily, it was well stocked. Whole lot of fruit. Fixed myself up. Worked on some prototypes. Obviously, that was all after she ditched me on Helios. You chose your side. There was an announcement and everything. That was... A um, huge mistake. Turns out, yeah. But when it all came down to it and you were faced with a choice, it was clear what was important to you. Meeting you, that vault key deal, was a disaster we didn't need in our lives. Are you serious? That is what you're pissed about? It was a little more complicated than that. What isn't complicated is the fact that you were making googly eyes at my sister the entire time you were around. Well, I came out with a few scars, too. Come on, punk. Quit stalling. Man, put some hustle in it. I, I ain't got all day. Hey, who is that? Yeah, what is this shit? A debt needs to be repaid. What is that supposed to mean? Get down there, fool! Yo, man, you didn't tell me this dude would be holed up in a bandit camp. The whole damn place was coming after me. You seem fine. I mean, I lost him, but I wouldn't stick around here too long. Just a matter of time before they come through. I'll take my chances. Psh, whatever. Oh, look here. We got Fiona and her corporate chump. The name's Reese, thanks. Look at you, all wrapped up like birthday presents. Hey, Kroger, where's your buddy? Oh, wait. I remember now. Oh, yeah. <laughs> remember why you can. <laughs> Look, I brought you your bandit box. We gonna make the trade or what? Two for one. Can't beat that. Take them. <laughs> no, they ain't making it out of here. This is personal. Hey, no, no! Stop! This is the end of the line, girl. You, you can't let him do this! So, you got some last words? Just to get him out now. Cause you know what they say payback is. I know you probably think it's your thing, but that mustache? It's awful. I'm waiting to hear that, cause I feel like a lot of people in your life are worried to tell you. Which is sad. Hmm. Huh. Shit talker to the end. You know... I can respect that. This one's for Finch! Whoa, whoa, whoa! Gross. Whoa. 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 Stop saying that! Don't even think about running.
hell is he doing? This... This is weird. I don't know. Maybe he has a question. Oh, <laughs> great! A firing squad! I just hit murder bingo! What do you want? All right! Laser pointers off! Laser pointers? The children of Helios try to avoid guns when it comes to conflict resolution. What? you buddy <laughs> same here man I can't believe this come on it's great to see you too Fiona we got a lot to catch up on but it's not entirely safe out here We'll take you back to the base. Base? Oh yeah. You're not gonna believe what we've done to the place. I mean, the whole thing was nuts! After Valerie beat the ever-living shit out of me, Cassius was nice enough to take me back to his lab and fix me up. The second time that guy saved my ass. I really owe him. The plan was to figure out a way to get you guys from Valerie. Then you left on the rocket and Valerie opened the vault and just all hell broke loose. I tried to find you guys, but eventually I started suspecting the worst. I didn't want to think that way, but... but... After a while, it's just hard not to lose hope. Honestly, <laughs> I'm just happy you're safe. Same here, man. The whole thing was so surreal, you know? I mean, Helios crashing. But by the time the dust settled, everyone was gone. Except for the ones that made it to the escape pods. Never expect to be leading a bunch of Hyperion refugees. I mean, they were crawling out of those things like newborns, just bleary-eyed and scared. Put your newly acquired Pandoran survival skills to work. You joke, but it definitely helped. I mean, look, obviously, I'm no expert, but I was light years ahead of these pencil pushers. I found JR from distribution eating dirt. Liter literally, just sitting there, just shoving dirt into his mouth. Really disturbing. I mean, most of these people... They hadn't spent a waking hour doing anything but just sitting on their ass, getting sweatier and fatter. <sighs> Which is why we decided to make our base out of what was left of Helios. Cool, right? Whoa.
Okay. Yeah, they're pretty deferential. Which is really odd for a bunch of ex-Hyperion. Hello! Wow. They must really revere you. <laughs> oh, that's not for me. They're bowing to you. But me? But this isn't for you? <laughs> You're kidding me. I wish I was. Look, they even have a shrine for them. Um, <laughs> that, that, that's a statue of Jack. Yes, very observant it was at one point, but uh, they went ahead and labeled it Reese. Someone tried to alter the face to look like you, but um, most of these guys are basically shitty at everything. I am pretty uncomfortable right now. That makes two of us. Reese, you don't understand. To them, you are the great liberator. You see, you crashing Helios shed them of their corporate shackles. I guess we'll see how this goes. <laughs> wow. <laughs> My forehead isn't really that big. <laughs> Is it? I told you, they're sucky. Kill it with fire. <laughs> hey! Oh, what? Did you forget we have a prisoner to interrogate? No. You're not even a little curious to hear what this guy has to say? I mean, yeah, but there's fruit. I'm talking to him. Okay, okay, okay. I'm coming. I'm doing the talking. Okay, I'll be the backup muscle. Why? Well, I got a gun. Okay, cool. Then Fiona, you're a bad cop, and I'll be good cop. Yeah, okay. I can do that. Answers and we want some questions. So you listen, buddy. You make sure to answer. Hey! No more games, asshole! Why'd you kidnap us? To learn the truth. Enough of the haiku bullshit. You give us straight answers when we ask you a question. You're supposed to be good, cop. Are you sure? Or else one of us, just slightly unclear which one, is gonna have to get mean. I saw people wearing those suits on the base. That means you were on Helios. Or at least around the crash site. Look, you obviously know us. You wouldn't be doing this if you didn't. So just, no more games. I do know you. Better now than I ever have. I was there. I was there when Gordas was destroyed. I saw the betrayal. I saw it, but I could not believe it. for only one thing. 
After giving so much, I had sacrificed everything for my friends, only to be betrayed. You asked earlier, why did I do this? The answer is simple. To bring my friends together, all of them. What about Hi. Yeah, hi. Uh, I have a lot of questions. I don't understand. I didn't either. I went back to Helios. I needed to survive. To find you. To learn the truth. <sighs> but why the disguise? I mean, why the secrecy? Huh? Why, why not just tell us? I was afraid if you knew who I was, you would lie about what happened. It is in your nature to... There. Right, Hyperion guy, con artist. It checks out. I really am sorry about... Gordas. I didn't have a choice. I know that now. I am sorry for not trusting you. Please forgive me. Oh, come on. How can you be mad at that face? <laughs> that is a face, right? I'm sorry, too. <laughs> reasons okay so obviously I'm excited to see Loaderbot too but it doesn't explain why you got us all together I mean I assume that's why you had me captured by that Kroger guy yes follow me I brought you together to help me assemble Gordas and summon the vault of the traveler whoa yeah Empty. Have you forgotten about the vault monster that nearly killed us? This time, it will be different. How? We will all be there to fight it. With some friends. We were unprepared. Weak. That won't be the case this time. That's not much of a plan. Not that I'm saying no. Why are we still talking about it? I'm in. Let's do it. For Gordas. And as a bonus, the treasure in that vault. Well, the endless riches is what usually motivates people. Whatever help the children of Helios can provide is at your service. Thank you. I don't have an army of former Hyperion weirdos. But I owe you my life. Killing the vault monster is the only way to ensure that Gordas can live in peace. The only way to save her. So, you, me, LB, Bond's on board. Hell yeah, he is. I can get Sasha here. No, oh, uh, so she's, uh... How many more we need? Vault Hunter teams are most effective in groups of four. Two teams would optimize our chances of success. Okay, so we need three more members. Loaderbot, any suggestions? It's all you. Okay, no pressure. Just give me a second to think. Who's stopping you? I'm a visual thinker. Yeah, I don't know what that means. I, I know the words that you just said, but not together like that. She achieves clarity through visualization. Oh, oh, okay, well, you know, why didn't you just say that?
How long are we supposed to wait? Unclear. Coward has to leave a recording. Actually, this is a live feed. Oh. I altered the echo calm to receive the signal. See? I'm waving at you. You can see this, can't you? There you are. I need you to know I did not betray you. It was all simply part of a longer calm that had some minor complications. It was always in the plan for it to look like the money was burned to bits. It wasn't in the plan for this armoire to be blown out of the back of the caravan and end up sitting in the middle of the desert. What are you getting at? Open the drawer. <sighs> that is a lot of dough. contains nine million dollars. I expect you to split that money with your sister. But I saw that case explode. When the caravan crashed, you were out cold for a bit. That's when I disarmed the Hyperion explosive and swapped the real money for fake, then rearmed the bomb. It needed to look like the money was gone and you had nothing to do with it. Valerie, Hyperion, they would all be after it, and I had hoped that I could draw their attention away from you. See the money go, and be able to blame me for it. Obviously, things did not work out that way. But I failed you. Had I planned things more thoroughly... You could have included us in the plan. We trained our whole lives for a score like this. I needed you to be able to honestly say, under harsh questioning, that the money was gone. We wouldn't have broke. I believe that, but it wasn't worth the risk. Now listen to me. That money will not solve everything. But it will get the both of you out of your life now and into one of your own choosing. The con game, it's not for you. Not because you aren't good at it, but simply because you deserve better. You should have a life where you aren't lurking in the shadows, afraid of being recognized. Afraid of being found out. Of retribution. This life. The hustle. It's all I know. And that is precisely the reason to walk away from it while you're still young enough to do so. I'll be in touch. Give Sasha my love. Wait, no! Damn it. That is nice of Felix to leave you the money, but... We are still short one team member. Please select a replacement team member. I guess we can afford the mystery choice now. I love surprises. That's settled. Let's go get our team.
I heard you were looking for the Gordas Core yourself. Well, that was before. I've abandoned that mission. My queue was too full. I've been there. They really start to pile up. Thank you for coming. Sure. I'm mostly here for the loot. Isn't Sasha supposed to be here for this? <sighs> Relax, she will be. She's rounding up the vault hunter we hired. We'll catch her up when she gets here. All right. So, in order to access the mysterious treasures of the vault... Ahem. ...and assure the safety of Gordas, we gotta destroy the monster that protects us. This is the Traveler. It's quite impressive. That's the largest vault monster I have ever seen. Oh yeah, it's big. It's nasty. It's gotta go. To make matters more fun and complicated, it teleports. Yay! Hence the whole Traveler thing. How do we deal with its teleportation? What little information we were able to gather seems to point to a gland, tucked in its giant tummy there, as the source for its teleportation abilities. Which is why... You and Sasha need to get inside it. When the Traveler teleports, there's a swirl of energy at the point where it's going to jump to. You so that when you get the caravan... The caravan? Yeah, that's what I said. It flies now, remember? You just gotta time it so that you're inside the energy thing when the monster shows up. Once you're in, you wire up the gland. Weird to keep calling it that. With explosives. Trigger the remote detonator and get the heck out of there. So what's everyone else's role? Good question. The B team, that's you guys, and whomever this vault hunter for hire is. You're saddled with the unenviable task of drawing the monster over to this area. You get the monster toward the vicinity of this ledge. It tries to jump into range. The caravan flies into the energy swirly thing before it jumps. So, <laughs> where do I fit into all of this? You, sir, are our motivational speaker. After the teleportation is offline, we need Gordas to wrestle the Traveler into place for the Moonbeam. And that's going to require some convincing. And that's what you and Loderbot are in charge of. Well, I guess... I guess this is what we're doing. Well, sounds good to me. At least, what I heard of it. I... I thought you were dead. <laughs> well, get over here! Oh, oh, come on. You know, I would... You, uh... Just <laughs> so happy to see you. Keep fun, ah! safe. <laughs> yeah, me too. Oh, yes, I saw that. Oh, hey. It's, um... It's good to see you, Reese. Like the new hair. Whole... Look, it works. Oh, thanks. Oh, but to be clear, is that a compliment from Reese or Jack? Right. Well, to be fair, Jack would have phrased it differently. I suppose you're right. All right, all right, enough of whatever the hell that was. What happened to the Vault Hunter you were supposed to bring? Right. Uh, okay. Um, about that... Oh, hell! I can't believe you f crashed Helios! That's f Who said you could do that? Zero is... Disappoint. Well, turn that emoji frown upside down, buddy. Things are about to get awesome. What a f crew you've got assembled here. It's a good thing you hired me. You could really use the even keeled professional temperament I bring to the table. Welcome aboard, I guess. Thank you. I feel welcome. I'm assuming the look on your faces has to do with the impossible task we're facing. Let me assure you, we'll get through this. With my vault hunting know-how and calm, measured approach, there's nothing we can't accomplish together. Whoa, wait a sec. Is that the monster we're fighting? <laughs> this is a suicide mission. We're all gonna die. Don't you see? I think I'd be fine with her at this point.